Make it dip. What's happening? I'm the pasta ten. All these ends, why you motherfuckers got to be? All these cops dip. again. Eat a box of something. I such a little watch with some rocks or something. What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? Ten. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Crown K. Thank you so much for stopping by. Please feel free to like, you know, stick around. So guys, um, let's get into this hair. I am going to be creating some bomb ass pigtails like for you guys today. At first guys, I washed my hair and like the night before and I put it into like some little twists. I was thinking maybe when I take them down, they'll be cute. But when I, when I got up, I realized that mm -mm, it was not gonna work so we're gonna make pigtails instead so guys I'm parting my hair it's literally gonna be down the middle but I don't want to just have it like straight down the middle I wanted something a little bit extra so I started my part with like a slant kind of thing and then I went straight down the middle I hope that made sense but that's how I'm doing it and guys the hardest part for me was getting this hair parted like the parting took forever I had to cut out like a lot of the bits and pieces but it took me a hot minute to get my parting <laughs> together. So don't worry if you do your hair and the parting takes you long. It took me long so you just didn't see that. But once I'm like satisfied with the parting and it's okay enough, I started brushing my hair out because it had the curls from the little twist that I made. So I'm just like really trying to get those out so we can start. And after like getting the curls out, I'm going to put that in like a scrunchie. Or a hair tie and I'm going to leave that and to move on to the other section so our hair is like parted in two and I'm good with it you can have yours straight down the middle or if you want to add like extra things with the parting and guys the trick is if you can do like straight down the middle just do like some zigzags like no one can tell you that that's not how it's supposed to look you just do it and rock it um yeah so I'm literally going in with this brush and this brush is from Careco brushes I don't remember what it's called but I use it a lot and I'm literally just detangling my hair and then I'm putting some oil on my part because my part looks a little bit dry so I'm combing it out and then we're gonna get into doing these pigtails so I'm gonna use my Star Factor Edge Booster and this is the original one and you know my method of doing my hair but I'm gonna tell you again when I'm doing my hair I part it and I go through in small sections that's the key to getting sleek hairstyles like sleek ponytails sleek anything on type 4 natural hair if you're not going to use heat and I did not use any type of heat so I had to go in and really part my hair so you're gonna do it in like small sections and add the edge control to the root and like back and front and then keep combing it out so you get the edge control from the root of your hair like up the shaft as much as possible and then you're just gonna keep combing that out smoothing and put it throughout the whole entire head and because this isn't a low ponytail because it isn't a low like ponytail well, pigtail we're just gonna keep adding it right throughout the head and once we're at the top that's when we move on to the other part which is the smoothing and the shaping as to where we want this pigtail to be so just keep parting and adding edge control in between and that's pretty repetitive and you're gonna do that until we're at the top so just keep on watching Batman, put you in a photo. I count down, she put me on a run down. Go down, she give me on a loop now. Go down anywhere you wanna go now. Batman, me I put you on a first class. Like, no, 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 no. And now that the entire like section is saturated, you're gonna go in with a rat tail comb and you're just gonna comb through and smooth, comb through and smooth and you wanna pull out your baby hairs at this point or your edges or whatever like I'm gonna be pulling out my edges so we can like you know do some baby hairs and you're gonna go in with your comb and you're gonna comb that bad boy out because you want this edge control like distributed properly so you're gonna comb it out and you're gonna keep smoothing with your hands like your hands is a major key like guys honestly I didn't even use a brush today like my hands do all the work so you're just gonna keep combing it and smoothing it and I realized when you use the edge control 
it straightens your hair like I don't know if it's only me but it straightens my hair so I use it and you're gonna keep combing and combing guys and smoothing until you get it to where you want it to be and then you're gonna you know do your little edge work like I don't think there's any like tutorial on edges or whatever like it's just whatever you want you can make your edges whatever you want as long as it's cute and you like it then do it I don't think there's any set way that you have to do it and yeah I'm gonna keep combing it in and getting it to where I'm going to you know put my hair tie and then guys I'm gonna go in with my clear ice gel and I put this over top to combat like the white residue that comes from the edge control when it's dry and guys even if after you use the gel you still have some type of white you can literally just get water on your fingers and rub it as to where you see the white but that's how it looks the pony not the ponytail oh my god i'm so used to saying ponytail the pigtail is neat and sleek and then i moved on to the other pigtail but i didn't like record doing the same repetitive thing i just did it off camera but that's what it looks like and i think everything looks really really neat everything looks so good and i'm just loving how everything looks and yeah guys i add oil sheen spray to my hair and then i'm using my rapid styling strips and this is like a major key like this is something that i have to use i feel like i if i don't use it my shit won't be i'm sorry I, if i don't use it my hair won't be as laid as it could be so i'm just really just tying my head up and i'm gonna go do my makeup and come back okay guys so for the hair we're using curls and curls clip ends and this is their thick kinky curly clip ends 3c slash 4a and it's 18 inches 220 grams and it's in a umbre color and that simply means it's dark at the root then there's color at the ends and i think this is like a number 27 color or 30 i don't know but it's umbre <laughs> so i used my can to define and shine custard on the clip ends and that defined the curls and then i just brushed them out and guys i attach the clip-ins by placing the first clip into my hair closing it and then wrapping it around and then at the end i place the other clip and guys let me tell you the pieces that i used i used uh, the clip-ins with five clips on it first on both sides then i used the clip-ins with four clips on both sides and then i went in for my last piece i used the clip-ins with three clips on it and i attached it and that's literally what I used to get my, get my pigtails. And for the last section, for the last piece with three clips, when you attach it in your hair and you wrap it around, for the end that you would normally attach the la the clip in, you're gonna take the like a piece from that end and you're just gonna wrap it around the base of the hair so it'll, it'll hide everything. Like I think this is the one that I show you how to do that. So yeah, you're gonna take it, take a piece of it instead of clipping it in your hair, and you're just gonna wrap it around the base so it covers all the tracks and everything, you know, looks well put together and seamless and you don't be out here looking crazy. And you're gonna get like some bobby pins and you're gonna pin it, and that's really just it. Like this hairstyle is so cute, so simple, so easy. Like you can do it, and as I said, if you can't do like a center part, like you can't part your hair straight, girl, do some curves, do some curves, do some zigzags, do something. Like it doesn't have to be straight. No one will know that that ain't the style that you did. Like come on now. And that's really it. And I'm gonna do the same thing to the other side, and that's like the end of the tutorial. Like if you like this tutorial guys please leave me a like please leave me a comment down below share with your friends guys we're trying to grow 30k is the goal right now so be be free like feel free to subscribe please and share this video with your family your friends thank you guys so much for watching yet another tutorial of mine thank you thank you thank you and i'll definitely be seeing you guys in my next one i love you guys so much Calling all your friends when they come through. Do the million number one I control. Do the bitty bitty friends for the girls when they come through. Come through. Bad man, say she want, say she really want, she try to be the one. Calm down, take it slow. Say the key, I let my phone in my yard, let my give me low. If you're tripping, let me know what you really want. Is it riding with me or you really dirt? Then my girl, then my tell me that you really not. Make up your mind, let me know if you really got. No, 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 no,